walk in after through the turnstiles, this is what you're greeted with. So we're gonna go inside now and take a look at, uh, they have scones, can't go wrong with scones. All right, we're gonna go in and check it out now. Thank you, sir. You bet. Oh crap, I got my son. Wow, big crowd. It's gonna be a big crowd. All right, man. Boat anchors galore. Boat anchors galore. <laughs> cool. Is this yours? Yes. Is it 35 for the whole thing with all the tubes in it too? Each tube is 30, no, okay. Yeah. <laughs> the whole thing. Yeah. The whole thing for 35? Um, did, uh, you had to get a look at the side of this. I'm oh, sorry. I was going to show you the side. It's, um, it's got nice graphics. Oh, yeah. Stuff. It's vintage, but it's a... Uh, That's really cool. It's a very solid case. It's uh, you know These are all wood, obviously. With uh, Yeah, and these are full tubes on both sides. Have they been tested? No unknown? No, I think these are mostly new in box tubes. 
Say know, that again. I, have, I think these are probably mostly new in box. New and new. All right. The same thing. This side's got you know feet in it too, but they're just. I have had like five of these things. So I've got all the tubes I need. How you doing, sir? I'm well, pretty good, but I get rid of some of this. <laughs> radio. Yeah. It's nice to find them in that condition. Lots of stuff down here. No, doors open, be careful. Wow. Warp Spicoli. Good luck getting parts for that. Ten bucks. If you, if you know what you're looking for. What's a, what do you, just out of curiosity, what, how much do you have? Well, I'm gonna let this go today for around 120-ish. But you know, this, if you look online, these go for like uh, 400 bucks. If you, if you restore them, recap them, which isn't hard to do. These are so easy to work on. Yeah, I mean, it's a great 
it's a great project you can turn it around. It hasn't been worked on? I, it has not been worked on. The guy that I got this from had it, had it plugged in. I didn't plug it in. I mean, it's a, it's a cinch, to, it's cinch to work on. Super clean. I'm making your mom video. Yeah. yeah. I didn't want to take the wrapping off, but if you that's, really into that, take the wrapping off. No, I wouldn't right now. I don't know. Oh, you're good. Good morning. No, you're good. I grew up with him carrying this everywhere. Oh, is that right? He's Hard to pass that up. It's called Guess What It Is, Chris. If you can guess what it is, they'll probably give you is a that, Is that what our, our tickets are for? If we guess, if we figure out what it is, we win it? free prizes. Off the table. So you guys honestly don't know what that is? No. I don't either. I've never seen one. Research <laughs> What are they? KLH. KLH. That's made with real wood. Well, real fake. Can you crank on that again for me? Huh. Huh. Thank you. Yeah, and see, this isn't turning, right? That looks like it should be turning to turn maybe something down here. So, so this on here is connected to here. Well, it's, 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 it's turning. See, this is what. Well, I mean, but see, this is threaded here. Yeah. And this is, is that, that's a gear there. I would think that that should be turning or, or moving in and out. It is turning. Is it just really slow? Oh, no, you're right. It's it not. doesn't turn. Uh, it and that's like a worm gear thing. Yeah. And, and unfortunately, this is seized up, but I believe when you shifted this out, then that lower stuff started working. Oh, I see. Well, if anybody knows what it is, wow. So, Western Electric Mystery. Fine machinist tools here. Brown and sharp. need right there. I've got that radio at home. I'm working on it right now. Is there a price on it? it needs what? Filler caps or something like that? Turn it around. Caps. What's on the back? Hang on. Well, I'll take that. I said it. Looks like the phone we had when I was a kid. Oh, 
this one. So it needs what? Filler what? Caps or something like that. It's on the wire. Oh, filter caps. Filter caps, okay. Filter caps. If I had a landline, I'd be tempted on this. That's a cool. How much is that? Two fifty. Yeah, it's hard to find these now. There's there's people that restore these though for you. Definitely cool. Let's move along. You're not buying. Nope, Cool-looking radios. They're leather. Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think I have chassis for them. Expensive. Look at this behemoth. Yeah, isn't that cool? numbers and everything are pretty much gone off of the yeah. Can't see Old school. Yeah. Here's another silver cone. That plays. Transistor. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. Guy likes his Emersons. Those are cool looking radios.
stacked in here like cordwood. either, huh? Well, the second floor. Two thousand twenty two Mike and Key, second floor. What model is that Philco? I'm sorry? That Philco? Mm -hmm. With the leather case, what model is that? Uh, let me see if I can help you there. Can take a picture? No, go ahead. Uh, well, I think I've seen that same logo on a Sears radio. That's nice. Nice. You know, in car. Oh, It is. Oh, come on, you gotta have a moment. D655 12Q, is that? Can I take a look? Certainly. Uh, <laughs> that's a. Thank you. Mm -hmm. How much is you asking for it? Uh, looks like 45. 45. But, but I'm not the official dicker. Um, oh, okay. I'm, uh, second in command on prices. Second so, in command. Uh, so I may, I may have some wiggle room on that. Well, Looks like it's ready for finish. Some of them came that way though. I don't know that radio. Afternoon, whatever it is. 